Hey everyone, it's Ashna. Um, today is the first weekly setup video that I've ever done on my channel. This is really different for me. Um, as you can see, I'm not even doing a voiceover. This is purely and completely in the moment. So hopefully these are like more chill kind of videos, less like edited, and I'm gonna try not to speed things up. So without further ado, let's get started. Cue the music, one, two, three, start. Perfect, okay. Now let's start on our very first weekly spread. Um, this one was my weekly spread in my plan with me video. Check that out if you haven't already. I will just give you some context. This month's theme is constellations um, and calligraphy. And to make this video flow a little better, I created just like some layouts just already made. So we can move along quick. So let's get started on week two and the first spread of this video. This layout has eight boxes here. So um, one for every day of the week and then there's gonna be one for like maybe notes or next week. Then I have my trackers up here and a big title. Let's get going on this. I'm gonna pull out my pencil case. It's over here. It's ginormous. I have like a bunch of stuff in here. I'm going to pull out and this is kind of all I need for this month. Actually, what I really like about it is because it's very minimal and there's barely any supplies that are used. And when I say minimal, it's not really that minimal. I'm not a very minimal person at all, so that's not very accurate. Let's start off with the title. Grab in the dual brush pen. For all the specific supplies, check out the description. Uh, and let's get going on this. I'm just using the tip of the brush. Okay, we got that down. So, let's do that. And I'm doing this roughly, like I'm not trying to trace it or anything. As you can see my hand is like shaking. Oh God, do you see that? Let's just, you know, patch that up. Right? Two. There we go. So I'm thinking we could put a constellation here. Um, and yeah. So here is the reference pic. Um, I've been using two of these constellations and a little spot here. Which constellations should I do? Mm, let's see, how about I do, I think so. Ooh, how about Capricorn? Capricorn would look good here, I think. Yeah, okay. So I'm going to grab my pencil. Sketching that guy out. So, just drawing those dots. A lot of stuff will make a lot more sense if you watch that video. So, check that out. Oh, and there's one here too. Okay, see, so we got that down. Now, I'm gonna get the fine liner. To finish off the spread, we'll add some stars because that just finishes off the whole thing. Now for the trackers. I'm gonna speed this part up a bit because it's not that interesting. So let's get coloring. One, two, three, go. I did it a little different this time. I put circles and then basically what I'm gonna do is when I complete the habit, I'm just gonna color the circle in. Okay, so now I finished the top. I do say so myself, it looks pretty good. So now it is time for these boxes. Oh God, why does that look so ugly? too much color on that. Hopefully it dries and is a little lighter. Now it's time to do the rest. I'm gonna speed this part up. Okay, so I just finished up and I'm actually super proud of these lines. Like compared this compared to that, like a pretty darn big difference, right? So I think the biggest thing was doing it from this angle really helped me. 
and also um, just doing one big stroke and just going for it was really helpful too because you can see I colored a lot and it just got really muddy and gross and now I'm gonna do the boxes okay now I am doing the last guy Look at this, now it's actually looking like a spread. So what font should I do? I mean, I'm asking no one and I'm just gonna be the one who ends up deciding, but let's have a, I'm gonna just gonna do, um, I'm gonna do a calligraphy. We'll be a bit more fancy. Okay, everyone, so this is the final spread for week two. Now, let's go to week three. So I'm gonna fast forward this one because we took a little while on this and I don't want this video to be ridiculously long. So the, I'm gonna stop in the middle, but I'm just gonna do the boring stuff and then talk to you guys when that's done. The lines that there's gonna be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven um, horizontal boxes for this week. Um, and I'm thinking for each box, I'm gonna do a different constellation. So, um, let's pull out the reference pick back over here, sweet. Um, so let's pick what we're gonna start off with. I don't know why, but I'm feeling like I really should do Pisces. Oh wait, and before I do that, I'm just gonna be doing some boxes. Guys, I just made such a huge little mistake here. Get it, huge and little? To me, it's huge. To some people, it'll be little. So, gotta patch that up. Let's grab some of this papier. Oh, by the way, guys, I actually really do speak French fluently. I'm not even kidding, I actually do. Like, I know maybe I sound sarcastic. I mean, I don't know, I might sound sarcastic. I'm not trying to be, but. I do speak French. I love speaking French, it's such a cool language. Oh, wrong one. There we go. Um, let's put this baby and do her justice. I mean, honestly, mistakes aren't the end of the world, but this one is so obvious that I just, I have to patch it up. So let's put that piece of paper there. Okay, so this is the glue tape. I did a review on it in my stationery haul video. Check that out. And oh, did you hear that sound? I find that so satisfying. I don't know, some people might find it gross, but you're gonna have to deal with it. Okay, so you see the adhesive on there? I don't know, it's like shiny. That's like, it's like double-sided tape in a dispenser. It's so easy and look, I just, oh, no. Nope. I just push it on there and boom, it's magic. Boom, it never happened. Poof. Okay, peeps. Oh dang, that sounded so much better in my head. Sorry. So we are done with the boxes. I think that looks super nice. Um, just so you guys don't get too bored, I'm gonna do all the calligraphy and then, and all the numbers and then I'll get back to you. So, I finished, and at the last minute, I decided to do stars. Um, if I'm really being honest, I kind of hate the stars. I feel like they just make it look like tacky, um, in my opinion. But I'm hoping that if I add a couple more stars, maybe it'll balance it off a bit. <laughs> I'm literally just trying to justify this because it looks so bad, in my opinion. I feel like I should have just stuck with um, with circles. I mean, that makes it look a little better, right? Maybe I'm just kidding myself here. Q reference pick. I know I keep picking that on and off, but I feel like it's handy for you guys. So let's draw our little Pisces over here. I'm thinking, why does that look so weird? Okay, so that's a star there. I've got circles over here. You know what, I'm gonna change the angle. Okay, this is a different angle. I think that's a bit better. And then we've got our little triangle. There we go. All right, Pisces. Is that even how you say it? I don't know. I'm guessing.
Um, as you can see, oh my god, what is wrong with my voice? Yeah, so as you can see, I am going, I am drawing, drawing, drawing. Okay, people, I am done this week for spread. She really like this one. Um, love everything um, about it, except it's quite busy. Like, there's lots going on. But other than that, it's pretty good. So now we are going to be doing week five, which I actually have no real... Oh, no, there's some bleeding here. Just checking that out. <sighs> it's fine. Um... I don't really have a good idea for this one. Hey guys, I also got some water because we need to be brainstorming. Oh, let me put it right there. There we go. Um, let's brainstorm some ideas. Okay guys, screen recording on. Perfect. And let's go into Pinterest. Shook. I already pulled this up, weekly spreads in the bullet journal. And let's just scroll through and see if we can find anything that looks interesting. I mean, it'll be me scrolling through, no one else, but you can come along for the ride. I mean, as you can see, I did this kind of layout. It's gonna be difficult. I like this, it's very simple. You know what, let's go for this one. I'll zoom like that, and let's get going on this. Seven, six boxes. Okay, she has one for the weekend. So one, two, three, Four, five, six, and then another quote. I love the quote. I'm gonna put another quote there. So that's the plan. So let me get going on the boxes. So, I just realized I wanted to put a quote here, but I did a box, so I guess there's gonna be no quote. Sad face. Okay guys, I finished the spread. I mean, it's, it's simple, but I love it. So, thank you to um, the inspiration pick that we found. Let's do a flip through. Okay, so. There we go. We are done. My January weekly spreads. What did you guys think? I hope you liked this chill sort of video. Oh my god, my hands look red. Sorry. Hope you guys like this chill sort of video. Um, I talked and I try to keep it more realistic and less edited and i hope that kind of style of video was nice the t these are the two videos that i want to do every month um thank you so so much for watching if you like this video give it a thumbs up because you liked it right i mean yeah and consider subscribing to my channel for more content and videos from me it means so much that you stick around you stuck around until now and happy january i love you guys all so so much and i'll see you all in my next one bye everyone